about ready to go for the start of game two. Softball doubleheader on the vstateblazer.com, powered by U.S. Education TV. Bill Munson and crew ready to go. I'm Ed Hooper. Let's see if the Blazers can start their another winning streak. This one right center field, the base hit to the fence. Runner going to come around and score. Delta State's going to take a 1-0 lead on the Blazers. As Brianna Hedgock delivers, grounder to Littlefield. She'll look at third, and she throws it past Samantha Posey. Gets by, a runner will come across to score. The throw to second is out. Two away, but an error on Marty Littlefield will bring Delta State another run across. Here's the 2-2. This one hit left center field. This one back. This one gone. A home run. Delta State has taken a 3 0 lead on a solo home run. And a grounder over to third in time, inning over. Johnson lays down a bunt right back to the pitcher. Throw to first, high over the head of the first baseman. Morgan Johnson will stay at first. All Britain goes down to second. Ambers are good on doom. Delta State here in this inning. Runners at the corner for the Blazers. Runner goes down to second. Morgan Johnson, ball goes in the outfield. Morgan Johnson's there on a stolen base. That'll go down as an E2, which will score Courtney All Britain. The Blazers have a run. One and two count. The pitch, Posey up the middle, the base hit. Johnson's going to round second, round third, and hold there. Now Posey's off the bat, but no one was covering first. So that's the first hit of the day for Valdosta State. 3-1 Blazers trail. The pitch outside. Runner goes, Fran Johnson. She's safe, and then Morgan Johnson will score. And toss. Chopper up the middle of base in. Fran Johnson had to hold a second to make sure no one made the grab. Here's the 0-1, and she tries to bunt. And oh, we got a pickoff move here with Fran Johnson. Runner's going to be safely boarded second. And Johnson is tagged out the 1 2. Swing and a miss, inning over. VSU gets two runs, though. Grounder to second to Hunt. To Hunt. Nice backhand. Throw to first big time. Beautifully done. April Hutchins. Wamsley lays down a nice bunt. Claire Wamsley tries to beat the throw out. She does. An infield single for Claire Wamsley, which was supposed to be a sacrifice. The 0-1 to Hutch. She lays down a bunt. It's a hard one. Gets by everybody into the hole. One run's going to score. They're going to wave Wamsley around to third. Hutch is going to take second. That is going to get out as an infield single. Maybe one of the rarest ones you're going to see in softball. Wow, what a play by April Hutchins. And actually, she's going to get a double on that. She also did out so much. That is going to be one of the rarest doubles you will ever see by April Hutchins or anybody. Look at this replay again. Just goes by everybody, trickles in the center fielder, and the shortstop had to come over and field it. Scores O'Connor, and we're tied at three. And she reacts it right up the middle, back to the pitcher. That is just a liner. Good awareness of the pitcher to make the catch. And a 2-2. Up the middle, this time he gets by the glove of the pitcher. One run will score, waving around another no. She'll hold that second, will Hutch, or hold the third. Morgan Johnson will take second on the throw in. It's an RBI single with one out for Morgan Johnson. Runners in scoring position. Posey grounds it to third. And Hutch is going to distract him enough. And trying to get the runners to second. They tag Hutch out, but that's a good job by April Hutchins. Hodge drew enough attention that let Sam Posey reach first and then go to second. Johnson reaches third. So to go down as a fielder's choice, Marty Littlefield at the plate. Morgan Johnson's at third. Samantha Posey's at second. The pitch hit high in the air. Behind second. Shortstop makes the catch. The inning is over. But the Blazers get the lead on two runs in the inning. Pitch from Brianna. This one hit deep left field. Morgan Johnson on the run at the wall. Oh, slams into the wall and she drops it. She is slow to get up. The runner's going to come all the way around and she will score. Morgan Johnson is hurt out there in left field. Her parents are right in front of us. I can imagine that's a scary moment. Moe's going to stay in the game. Natalia Morzova leads off the inning. A bunt to the pitcher, throw to first, not in time. Here's the 2-1. And over the head of the shortstop. Around comes Natalia. Blazers lead, 5-4. 
much. This time grounds to the third. Nice snag, and the throw to first is in time. The inning is over. Hancock delivers to Abair. This one popped up in the infield. Hancock has it easily up one for the first out of the fourth inning. This one grounded right back to Brianna Hancock. Throws the first inning over. This is a grounder to third, throw to second, dropped by the second baseman, and Courtney Albritton was told to stay at second. Instead, she comes to third, beats it out. Morgan Johnson will stay at second. That'll go down as a fielder's choice and an E, a an e, fielder's choice 5 4 E2. And now the Blazers have runners at the corner with nobody away. Should have been one. 2-1, and Littlefield, right center field, there's gonna be some RBIs. One run's gonna score. The ball that bounces away from the right fielder. One run's gonna come around, two runs gonna come around. Marty Littlefield's gonna be in there safely aboard at third. Will it be a triple? All the way around. They, the right fielder kind of bombed the ball out there in the fence, it just bounced off the fence. So a two-run triple for Marty Littlefield. In that first game, and takes this one. Little blooper, left field. Catch made by the shortstop, just barely. Inning over. It's 7 4 Blazers. And Albright takes this one for a ride. See you later. Courtney Albright, her 13th homer of the year. 8 0 4 Blazers on Courtney Albright's 13th home run of the season. The 3 2. And Johnson hits it right field. This one back. This one off the top of the wall. They say it's not a homer. It looked like it hit the yellow to me. It's going to be a triple. I thought it hit the yellow, which makes it a home run. The umpire says no. And the heart of the order of Samantha Posey. Liner to center field. Catch made. Jumps and tags. And she can jog in. 9 4 Blazers. Grounded to short. Throw to first. Did time. Inning over, but Blazers get two more runs in kind of quick fashion. Pitch coming from Brianna Hancock. This one hit right at April Hutchins. The five foot four second baseman jumped up and snatched it out of the air right there. As this is a strike three counter looking. Inning over. Blazers are three outs away for victory, but will get one more chance to swing the bats. This one hit right field. Natalia Morozova is now three for three in the second game. And hits this one high in the air. The wind is gonna bring this one in play. A catch made there by the left fielder. Since this one's popped up right field, inning over. Blazers don't get any runs. Lead 9-4, going to the seventh inning. Three outs away from a win. In a pitch, for foul by sustained. The senior from Plainfield, Illinois, Julia Fee, gonna get an opportunity to pitch in the circle on her senior weekend. Her parents in attendance. Grounded right back to her. Throws to first, one away. Julia Fink records the out. Here's the one-two. Grounded, Fink has it, throws to first. Ball game over, Blazers are 43-3 this season. Blazers win 9-4, headed to the Gold South Conference Tournament with a 26-1 conference record. Thanks for watching, have a good day.